And I'm again year eight and we're now looking at lesson seven and we're going to work with something called local links. They're the hyperlinks from one page in your site to another. Uh, and in order to do that, we'll be using something called the A or the anchor tag, tag. And the anchor tag allows us to use one of its attributes called the href or the hyperlink reference. So I can jump from one page in my website to the next. However, before you can do that, you're going to need a second page. So hopefully by referring to your earlier tutorials and following this video, you should be able to set up a simple second page, which is going to be your computing portfolio. So to revise quickly, I'm going to create new and in the same folder again as all my other work, this is going to be a text document. And in fact, I'm just going to delete that and I'll set it up. I'll just run my notepad and I'll Got a blank text document and I'm going to create my website. Very basic at the moment. Start with your HTML, put in a header, and give them the title and the bar, my computing work. I've set the same colours for my first page and it's just got one header that says my computing portfolio. And remember, we go file, save as. It asks in your tutorial to call this computing and save it in the same folder all your other work so I'm going to call it computing.htm and remember importantly it's no longer a text document we're changing it to all files and I'm hitting save so I'm going to close that and you can see now I've got my first page and computing I open this up and you can see we've got our second page so I'm going to be working with two pages today we're going to start in our first page and you can see mine's a little bit messy from last lesson, but I'm going to be able to link from this page and arrive here. So let's look at how we're going to do that. I'm going to open up my first page because this is where I want to place the link. Open with Notepad. And where have we got some space? Down here at the bottom, I'm going to put in my anchor tag. A for anchor. The first attribute we're using is the hyperlink reference and I give it the exact name of my file which was computing.htm. I'm closing the opening tag and I'm going to give some text for the link. Click here to see my computing work and then I'm going to close my anchor tag. I'm going to save that and let's refresh my first web page i hit f5 and you can see here i've got a hyperlink click here to see my computing work and it goes to my computing portfolio so second when we're in my computing portfolio i'm going to need a link to take me back let's open up my computing page in the notepad and i'll put in a very simple link underneath here for home and it's going to be a hyperlink reference equals I call mine first dot htm close the string close the angular brackets click here to return home and I close my a tag and I hit save I go back to my browser and I can refresh this and I've got home whoops mistake let's try and troubleshoot this why the a hyperlink reference equals first dot htm what have i done here let's look at the name of my file fis oh look my bad i spelled that differently so i should be hyperlinking to fis or t so i'm gonna have to go back and change my programming fi s or t see what happens when you've got a spelling mistake there's an important lesson on troubleshooting for us so i'm going to go to computing i'm going to refresh that and hopefully this time yep it takes me home and i can click here and we've inserted with those little problems our first hyperlink reference so refer to your notes it'll take you through how to set up your second page and it references here how you can hyperlink and then your task is to have your second pages that will jump back and forward again any questions just shout on your team good luck